Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So um, today I am going to go through and tell you what I got my kids for Christmas. I have a 10 year old son named Landon and a four year old daughter named Paisley. Um, I did one of these videos last year. I felt like it was really helpful. These videos are also very helpful for me. Um, I watch them to get ideas for my kids. Um, I was actually stumped on what to get Landon this year just because as he gets older, um, it just becomes more difficult to buy for him. So, you know, I was like trying to pull ideas out of him and I was getting maybe like three ideas. So I watched a lot of YouTube videos trying to just find something that other 10 year olds like. So I got a lot of ideas from watching videos like these, so I thought I would make one for you guys. I usually post one of these videos more the beginning of December, but um, better late than never. So uh, last year I started with Paisley on what I got for her. So this year we're gonna start with Landon. And I warned him, you know, your gifts may look smaller this year because I feel like as kids get older, their, kid, their, their gifts, get smaller and more expensive. So her gifts are kind of big and bulky and it looks like she has more, but I always try my very best to get them both the same amount of gifts every year because we don't need any arguing on Christmas day. So um, I'm gonna start with him. So I'll kind of move everything off to the side so we can focus on one thing at a time. Um, Okay, so the first thing that I got for him, which was not his idea, but I thought he would love this, are the um, LED lights. Um, I got this off of an idea from YouTube, but um, they're like little LED strip lights. You can basically put them anywhere. I've seen them put underneath the bed, like right underneath the bed to where it looks like the bed has lights underneath it or, you know, around the room at the top in the corners. I did hear that this um, we'll take paint off the wall. So uh, we're probably not doing any of these on the wall. Um, so maybe like I've seen like behind a dresser, like at the very top or, un you know, like I said, underneath the bed or underneath the table. I thought that was a really cool idea. He loves things like this. So I thought this would be a great gift for him. And then um, this, you can't really tell what it looks like, but it is a Minecraft uh, blanket. I thought it was going to be bigger. I got this from Target. Oh, and I, I guess I'll tell you where I got everything. Uh, the LED light strips are from Amazon. There were many, many kinds. I just looked at reviews and all that. Um, but this is from Target. I thought, this is a little blanket, but it's all wrapped up. I will uh, try to insert a picture so you can see exactly what it looks like. Um, but yeah, it it's not as big as I thought it would be, which is disappointing, but that's okay. Because he does have a million blankets, but I thought, you know, he would like to have... A Minecraft blanket and then he had been asking forever for Lego palm trees mom I want Lego palm trees so finally on Amazon I found a whole package of Amazon it's more like a look it looks like a rainforest so you've got like the Lego plates or whatever they call them um, there are a couple of those in there and then a bunch of different trees but some of them are palm trees so um, can't really tell what it looks like in the package but I'll have the picture here for you so you can kind of get an idea, but that was something that he had been wanting was Lego palm trees. This is not the Lego brand, but it is compatible with Lego. So that's great because he has a god awful amount of Legos. So he will be very excited about this. And then the next thing that I got for him is this smartwatch. So he, it's, he has one just like this, but it's the, I think we got it in 2015, so five years ago. So this is kind of the updated version of this um, watch. And he loves it. He takes pictures and he, you know, I don't know, takes videos, records himself and plays games on there. So this is, you know how like phones upgrade? Well, these watches upgraded. So he's kind of got the older version. He wanted the newer version. So I got him this. It's the VTech smartwatch. You can get this on Target, web, the Target website or on, I mean, in the store as well. But um, I think I might have gotten this on Amazon. I can't remember. But either one, carry it. They come in different colors. I think uh, black, blue, pink, and purple maybe. Yeah, but we got him the blue. Um, he has, he already has blue. I was like, you want black? He was like, no, I want blue. So got him blue again. And then he is really into the stars and the moon and the sun and planets and space and all of all that stuff. So this is a, um, 
Aurora Starry Sky Projector. I got this off of Amazon. I saw the um, review pictures that people had taken when they had used it and the, the pictures were really, really cool. So he will, I'm sure, have this in his bedroom and he will love this. So um, yeah, but I will have everything linked below so that you guys can look over it. And then Landon is obsessed with Unspeakable on YouTube. Um, some of your kids may watch Unspeakable, I don't know, but he does a lot of crazy things. You know, has like a million uh, of those balls in his house that you have in like the ball pits and he's like, his whole house is flooded with those and then he jumps in or they jump, you know, just crazy stuff. So he has merch. So Landon wanted some Unspeakable merch. So one of them was this plush stuffed animal right here. I said, you really want this? He said, yes. I'm like, all right, so we got him this, and it's got Unspeakable's name on the head, so I'll probably stick it on his, his bed or something. And then he wanted the um, LED sword. So here it is, and it's got, yeah, it's got Unspeakable on both sides, so that's another thing that he wanted. And Landon is also obsessed with expensive cars. guess that's a, a boy thing. Thing. Um, but yeah, he loves Lamborghinis and Ferraris and he talks about them all the time. I think I talked about that in my Easter video. Mom, when am I going to get my Lamborghini? He would ask me. So, um, yeah, no, never. He got a Lamborghini uh, Lego set for Easter in his Easter basket. And then I got him a um, Lamborghini remote control car. So he is, I'm sure, going to be very excited about that. And this was from Amazon, maybe? I'll have it linked, but yeah, he is going to love that. And then this is a remote control drone. You can't really tell what it looks like um, on the packaging, but I'll have a picture to where you can see. I guess the um, color options are blue, green, red, and yellow, and I got the blue one. It, it Yeah, remote control drone. It says 14 plus, but Landon's really good um, with things like this, remote control stuff. He's very good with keeping things, you know, steady and all that. So, I just heard a noise and I'm home by myself. And then I got this idea from uh, the Rambling Redhead on, that's her um, Instagram name, from, um, from Instagram. She had shared this magic set and her kids supposedly love it. They love doing things like that. So I really, really, I looked at it for a long time. So I'm like, is this really something that he will like? It's, it's for ages six plus, but, um, he'll talk about magic sometimes, you know, especially since the elf has been here, you know, the elf on the shelf. Um, we'll talk about magic, you know, so I thought it has 125 magic tricks. There is a Amazon version of this, and then there's a Target version, and I really can't remember which one I got it from. I feel like it was Target, but I could be wrong. So again, I will have it linked, but there are 125 magic tricks, and I hopefully, hopefully he'll think that's pretty cool when he figures out how to do all of this, and then, you know, show me and Daddy and Paisley. And then this was kind of a last minute gift um, because I was I was just sitting there like I, I don't know what else to get him. So I'm like scrolling on the Target website just for ideas for 10 year olds. And he has um, Cosmo. If you've ever seen the little robot Cosmo, he's so cute. He was very expensive. He got it for Christmas from uh, my dad and stepmom a couple years ago, but he loves him. So this one was about half the price, but I will have this linked also. Landon's always loved robots, anything, you know, remote control where he can make it do different things. And um, this one, uh, this has all kinds of crazy, I mean, he rolls around. You can, has like a little basket you can attach to him and he catches the balls and I think he inter interacts with you a little bit. A lot of stuff on the back that would take me forever to read, but he seems like a pretty cool, fun toy. So I got that for him as well. And then he had asked for another Nerf gun, and I promise that he probably already has, I don't know, eight or ten, like, huge ones. So I'm like, do you really need another Nerf gun? But he did. He, he needed it. He told me that he really did need it. So this is the uh, Fortnite Nerf gun, and... It's huge, but I got it for a pretty decent, I think it was maybe around 20, 
I can't remember, but um, I got this from Target. So this is another to add to the collection. That's very, it's very different from what he already has. So I was like, oh, okay, okay, we'll just, we'll get that then. So that's that. And then his last gift is this Lego house. So he builds his own Lego houses. Like he just kind of makes it into what he wants it to look like. But I had him look, cause he said, I want a Lego house, like an actual house with instructions. Like, you know, he, so he pulled up, we pulled up this one and this is the one he wanted. And this is the um, townhouse pet shop and cafe. So I don't know, I can, I can have a picture up on the screen for you just so you can kind of, this was a little pricey, but Legos, I mean, a set this big is $20. So, you know, this was a little on the, the pricey side, but you know, it's Christmas and you know, I don't buy stuff like this throughout the year. So why not? So that is Landon's next gift or last, I should say last gift, and then at the end, I will go through um, the stocking stuffers also, which I didn't go through last year. So that's kind of nice if you're looking for different ideas for stocking stuffers. So we will um, start with Paisley. And I did forget to add one thing. So Landon's last gift is um, a telescope. It's something that, that is the one thing that he asked for was a telescope. So my husband was able, which, you know, he ordered it at the last second. So it's going to be here before Christmas. I'll have the picture inserted, but that was the, really the only thing that he really, really wanted and asked for. So we got him a telescope. I know he's going to be super excited about that. I just can't wait to see their faces on Christmas morning. So we are moving on to Paisley. Her stuff, like I said, is a lot bigger. So it really looks like she has more, but she doesn't. So the first thing is this little makeup set. That is one thing that she did ask for was makeup. Um, only problem is she's four and she's so incredibly messy and we've got her sets like this before. And it like, you know, she, instead of just lightly, you know, putting it on, she digs the little brushes and stuff in there and just makes a mess. And there's, you know, but whatever. So um, there is that little set. I think I got this off of Amazon as well. So that's something that she will be super happy about. I also got her one of the um, smart watches, uh, Kitty Zoom VTech smart watch. And I got her a pink one. She always sees Landon playing with his and you know, they always have to fight about it for, you know, 20 minutes straight. So they're each gonna have their own. They can do their own thing and super cute. I love the pink. And then this is one of the OMG lights dolls. I asked her if she wanted, like I showed her a picture of it because I was trying to get ideas for her as well. And she said she did not want one, but I got her one anyway because she doesn't know that she's going to like it, but she's going to like it. So, um, they're just, I feel like they're kind of a bigger, larger version of the LOL dolls. They're just, you know, taller and it comes with 15 surprises and they're, they're super cute. Like I kind of wanted to get one for myself. So I just feel like girls are so much more exciting to shop for, you know, especially at this age when the, I had so many ideas for Paisley. I mean, it was like, I have, I mean, my list was like this long, but I think it's just because she's younger. She's a girl. She's just easier to buy for. Landon was that the same way at that age too. I felt like I could buy everything for him, but it just gets harder as they get older. Um, I saw this recommended on Instagram by uh, someone that I follow, and it is the um, the Polly Pocket says Micro Unicorn Party. So uh, I'll insert a picture so you can see it better. But this whole thing opens up and has like you know one of the little dolls in there. I don't know if it has one or two, um, but the the girl that was talking about it said her her girls played with them for hours. So. We need toys like this. Um, but yeah, I thought that was super cute. It has a little handle at the top for you to carry it around. And she doesn't know anything about it, but I got it for her and I hope she likes it. So another thing that she asked for was the um, kinetic sand. This is a terrible mom move, but I got kinetic sand for her last year. I got her a bag about this big. And it wasn't, it's not messy sand, like regular sand. If you have had this, your kids have had it before. It's really not messy. Like it doesn't fall apart like regular sand. But, you know, I just hate messes in general. Um, if 
you watch my other videos, you know I do a lot of cleaning videos. So I'm kind of a, a OCD about my house. So she played with it for two days and I threw it away because a lot of it would, you know, end up on the floor. And then she kept asking about it and I felt terrible and I'm like, I'm a terrible mom. So here we are. I bought it again and I bought two packages. So this is just sand by itself. This is the purple. And then um, with this, I didn't know what color I was going to get. It just says colors may vary. So I thought, whatever, if I get pink, blue, purple, whatever. This is blue and it comes with um, a little tray, which is nice because we didn't have the tray last time. Maybe that was the problem. It was just kind of on the kitchen table. So this comes with a tray and, um, you know, like little sand molds. It looks like a little turtle and a crab or something and then like little um, shovels and stuff so this is actually a, a two-in-one I'm gonna put this together so this can count as one so um, she's gonna be excited about this and um, it's gonna be messy but you know that is okay because it's not about that it's not about mess it's about fun and your kids enjoying stuff and I need to get over that so so Paisley loves to dress up she has several um, I don't know if you want to call them costumes but little dress up outfits and she has a few Elsa ones, but this one I found on Amazon. Um, it was unlike any of the ones she had or that I had seen. It had really, really good reviews on sort of pictures so you can see. Um, but it comes with the, I think it comes with like a wand and a crown and like a little hair braid thing. Um, but it was just, they, the people in the, in the reviews, because I always read the reviews on everything before I buy. And they just said it's the quality's really, really nice. And I just thought it was really cute. I think she'll love it just to add to her little collection. So the next thing is this um, baby in a car seat. I don't know. No, it's not a car seat. I think it's one of those things like that you strap on your back or your front. And she will love that. She doesn't have, she has a lot of babies, but she doesn't have anything like this. So. Well, it does say baby with the car seat. Dream collection, baby with the car seat. You can strap it on your back as well, which I think she'll she'll like. It has a little bottle and like a little rattle and a sippy cup and a bib with it as well. So, there you go. And her next gift is also messy, but that is okay, um, is Play-Doh. So, she is the type that likes to mix all the colors together, which drives me crazy. But, um, you know, and then we end up throwing it away because like there'll be like hard pieces that you know, are left out or it doesn't get shut all the way. So I bought her another set. This is something else that she asked for. I can't remember if this is from Amazon or Target, but it comes with 12, all the different colors. And then she has like a ice cream maker and things like that for this to go with. And I also, I think our family's just obsessed with blankets. At least I am and the kids are. I don't know about AJ, but um, I feel like I always need to get them a blanket for Christmas. This is frozen. This is what I want landed. This is what I wanted Landon's blanket to look like to be more like you know puffy and cozy and furry but it wasn't it was like small and thin but that's something I didn't do is read the reviews because when I went back and looked because I thought somebody would have said something about that and they said this blanket is so thin so that was my mistake I didn't re read the reviews on that particular blanket but this one is very nice very very cozy and then this is a present pet i don't know if this is something new um but i saw it advertised either on a commercial or i looked in the target catalog i can't remember but this thing is super cute you open it up and you i think it like busts out of the box itself which is so cute and it it's kind of like a little interactive toy unwrap pull the tag and your puppy comes to life um, it loves to play games, get cuddles, give kisses. I think it moves, I'm pretty sure this thing like moves around. One puppy included, and this is I think the fancy, there's different types with the present pets. This is the fancy pup or puppy or whatever. It says it has a hundred sounds and actions. Um, so this should be pretty fun. I was I watched a video on it to see what it does because I kind of I, I also watch videos to see what these toys do you know it might the video might start and I think well that's that's not they're not going to care about that but this this looked really really fun I thought she would really like that and then this was also something I watched a video on this is the um, Disney Frozen 2 Elsa swim and walk so it's got Elsa 
with the horse. He walks around. She rides on it. And I'm almost positive, yes, swims in water and walks on land. I watched a video on it. It was very cool, and I knew she would love this. So my husband said she saw, she saw it at the store and kind of pointed it out. So I was excited when he told me that because I had already bought it. And then this is also, this is another gift that I wanted for myself. I don't know why, but I think it's because I know I would have liked this when I was little. I would have definitely played with this. But this is, this is the LOL Surprise Carpool Coupe. Um, it doesn't come with the large doll, but it does come with this, you know, one of these little dolls here. I watched a video and the car is decent quality and these sold out so fast and so did, what else sold out fast? Oh, I think it's something that I'm going to show you here in a second. Or no, it was the, no, it was the frozen, um, with the horse and everything that sold out super fast. So I was glad that I did my shopping early this year because I would have missed out and then they still been sold out when I looked after, you know, so I was really glad that I was able to snag one of these. And then this is also super cool. I watched a video on this. Um, he rolls around on, I guess, like a hard surface, but he talks and interacts with you, and it comes with this um, flashlight. And I guess what's, when, it, when you turn the lights off and you shine the flashlight on the ground, which makes a snowflake, he will follow the snowflake as you walk, which I thought was really cool. Um, let's see. Oh, he's going to sing the whole song. He's so cute. She will love that. His little eyes blink. How cute is that? Um, the last gift, which is in our garage, and it is not put together, um, but it is her Barbie dream house. She has the frozen castle in her room, and I told my husband we can't have both because she got the, the castle earlier this year, I think. Um, but I'm like, you know, we need to get rid of the, the frozen castle, but at the same time, she loves it, so I don't really know what we're going to do, but we got her the Barbie dream house that she'd been asking for, sold out everywhere like I would say it, it has been sold out since before I don't know if it still is but before or right at Thanksgiving weekend it was sold out so my husband managed to find one at a store about 30 to 45 minutes away from here thank the Lord because we were desperate because that was uh, her big gift that she asked for so she will be so excited about that we'll have it put together on uh, Christmas Day but it is out in the garage right now in a box. But I think that is everything and I will go through with you really quickly what I put in their stocking. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to go through really really quickly what I got each of them for their stocking. Um, I think Paisley might have a little bit more, but you know, I mean, it, it can't always be equal. So I tried my best. Um, I will start with Paisley this time. I got her this frozen thermos. Um, we use it, she uses it a lot for dance. When she goes to dance, we put water in there. It stays cold a long time. The ice doesn't melt for a long time. So these are very nice. I think it was about $15, so. And then I got her some of these little bath drops that are fun that changes um, the bath water color. There's uh, You can make colors by combining two or you can just use one. This is a little um, Barbie, I, don't, I guess they're like little purses. But um, just to throw in there and I got her uh, a candy cane full of M&M's, I think it is. Chocolate lentils. What the heck is that? I thought it was... Hopefully it's M&M's. I don't know what chocolate lentils are. But, um... Then I got her this little paint set. It's Minnie Mouse. So she will love that. I got her this little headband. Also, I got her some um, Disney Princess chapsticks those in there as well and then I got this little it says Barbie brand but it's just a little bunny with um, a, it sits in a little basket and has a carrot I got her some uh, flip and flarp so it's like I guess it's like slime or some type of putty it has glitter in it and it says no okay noise putty and glitter putty so one's pink one's blue so she will love that as well. I got her this little LED glow art. It has the little um, peg things that you push into the board that lights up. 
So I'll put that in there. Also, I got her one of these big candy canes. I got her this little space robot guy. Um, it has lights and sound. And I tried to get some of the same things for both of them because they, I feel like they fight over everything. So uh, this is a Lip Smackers uh, Lip Gloss, Lippy Pals Gloss. I think I got that at CVS when I was in there getting something. And then I got Blow Pops Ring Pops, which will, I think there's four in here, so I will give each of them two. So, Landon, oh wait, I have one more. And then this, this was a really, really, really good deal. This is obviously not going to fit in her stocking, but a lot of times if I have bigger stuff for their stocking, I just kind of set it on the bench down below the stocking. But this, I think was $8, like $7.99. I thought this little um, notebook was going to be smaller, but um, it's big. It's big, I feel like. And it has the pen with the little um, fuzzy thing at the top. I thought that was super cute. And then Landon, I got him this little light up top and it just, you know, just spins. And then I got um, this little thing. Some of this stuff is from Dollar Tree and then some of this stuff is from Target, just like random stuff that I picked up. So some of it's kind of like little cheapy stuff and then some of it is more, you know, whatever. So um, it says bolts. I don't know, it's from the Dollar Tree. You can, he, he can build a helicopter, so he'll like that. This I have not opened up yet, but I ordered this off of Amazon. Shark Puppet. I don't know if you even know what that is or who that is, but he has been wanting this for a while so he can make noises with his mouth and, you know, make this do whatever. So. He wanted this, and I thought, I'm not giving this to him as a gift. We will put that in his stocking. We will throw that in there. So I also got him one of the large candy canes and the chocolate lentils, whatever that is. Hopefully they're M&Ms, but I got him one of those as well. I got him some of the bath drops because he still likes them at 10 years old. So I got him some of those. I got him... Um, some more darts for his Nerf guns because I feel like you always end up losing darts. They're always like under your couch or under your bed or weird places. So I got him a, um, a box of darts. I also got him the noise putty. His is just blue. I got them both airheads. So I'll just divide them up in their stocking. He also got one of those space robots that have light up and have noise. This is something he ordered from the Unspeakable website that he wanted, and it's a kazoo, so I will love hearing that, I'm sure. Um, but it's got Unspeakable on there. It's a kazoo, and I'm going to put that in his stocking. This is a letter rip sound machine. I'm guessing there's probably some, uh, some fart noises on here, but I got this also at the Dollar Tree. Uh, six extraordinary sounds, so that will, that will also keep him entertained and loud as usual and his last uh, stocking stuffer is a toothbrush and it is the secret life of pets whatever one or two or i don't even know but it's got the little thing at the top it's a little cover for the top of the toothbrush i thought that was kind of cute so yeah i think that is everything hopefully i didn't forget anything but thank you so much for watching my video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new and i will see you in my next video bye